a renowned music educator with more than 30 years of professional experience to her name, Paula Ruth Kaplinger gravitated toward her career path early on in life when her mother, Evelyn Ruth, a gifted musician herself, taught her how to play the trumpet. Ms. Kaplinger's sister, Ling, learned to play the alto saxophone, and their brother, Will, learned to play the baritone horn. The family would often go out on the lawn and perform concerts, providing Ms. Kaplinger a glimpse into her future. A Sacramento native, Ms. Kaplinger was a prolific musician throughout her adolescence. By the time she graduated from high school, she had won five music scholarships, which allowed her to set her sights on college. This she considered a highlight and start of her career. Ms. Kaplinger attended Sacramento City College and California State University, Sacramento. She was one of only two Sacramento City College students selected to perform with the Western States Junior College Honor Band at its performance in Provo, Utah. At the pre-concert auditions, Ms. Kaplinger won a seat as first chair trumpet against a field of 33 trumpeters from various Western states. She also played in the Sacramento Symphony Brass Demonstration Group. They would perform at elementary schools and play concerts for the children and explain how each instrument worked. She was immediately amazed by how it all made the children light up. This sparked a desire in her to pursue education and bring music to young people for a living. Ms. Kaplinger became involved in educator-based unions and committees as a result of a school board meeting she attended with her roommate, Lynette Tanaka, that left her appalled at the attitude the board had toward the teachers. This opened her eyes and prompted her to become an active volunteer in the local, state, and national teachers unions where she learned about politics and how to organize in support of educators and students. This set the stage for her efforts later in life, working within teachers unions and being a state organizer throughout California. Ms. Kaplinger earned a Bachelor of Arts degree in music from California State University, Sacramento in 1973 and subsequently became a certificated elementary teacher in California. Ms. Kaplinger was hired by Sacramento City Unified School District as a traveling instrumental music teacher in 1973, a role she maintained until 1992. From 1992 until her retirement in 2008, she taught middle school instrumental music and supplied plenty of impact within the district. As a teacher, she was given the opportunity to conduct the All City Junior High School Band and Orchestra alongside her colleagues, which was a career highlight since it consisted of all the best student musicians from the Sacramento School District in one group. They practiced one night a week, leading up to a grandiose concert in the spring. Additionally, her great leadership brought her jazz band to a music competition, where they received an excellent rating. She is particularly proud of helping one young student to learn how to play the baritone horn. He previously had five strokes when he was born, so his right hand was incapacitated. He used his left to play and ended up playing all throughout high school and in the marching band. She similarly helped a student with Asperger's learn how to play the trumpet. The young lady turned out to be so naturally gifted at the instrument that she became the only student in the school one year to make it into the All City Band when she was in the seventh grade. Throughout her career, she, Ms. Kaplinger, never told a student no, they couldn't be in the band. She believed everybody could learn something within music because it was always a useful, personal, and reliable art form. Music is lifelong, she said. Ms. Kaplinger also found success as commissioner of the California Teacher Competency Panel since 1988 and previously served as co-coordinator of the Pacific Telesis Shared Decision-Making Project at Will C. Wood Middle School, was a member of the restructuring committee within the Sacramento School District, and co-authored a new elementary band curriculum. Although her primary role was as an educator, Ms. Kaplinger has remained extremely active as a musician throughout her career. She was first trumpet for the Sacramento Valley Wind Ensemble from 1986 to 1991, has played in the Sacramento Symphony and American River College Community Band, was part of the backup band for Smokey Robinson, and performed in the Sacramento Music Circus alongside major stars such as Liberace. More recently, she has played trumpet in the Jabberwocky Good Time Band in Ashland, Oregon since 2018. Ms. Kaplinger has also kept busy in roles within the professional organizations in her field. She has been a member of the Board of Directors within the California Teachers Association, among several other positions since 1993, and a delegate for the National Education Association since 1988. 
In addition, she has been affiliated with the Music Educators National Conference, National Association for Music Education, Consumer Federation of California, and Sacramento City Teachers Association, which granted her a Golden Apple Award in recognition of her myriad achievements. She also received a WHO, We Honor Ours, recognition from the California Teachers Association. She retains a life membership as a retired teacher in the local SCTA, State CTA, and National NEA teachers unions. Ms. Kaplinger has led an accomplished and impactful life and career marked by compassion for others, dedication to her craft, good temperament, and a healthy sense of humor. Addressing future educators, she advises that they do not teach the same thing twice in a row in the same way. Have a variety in your toolbox, she encouraged. It's more interesting for the kids, and it helps them learn better because they learn differently. Moreover, she encouraged budding teachers not to quit, despite the obstacles that come with teaching, especially in public schools. She added that if you have a good working relationship with your principal, your administrators, the parents, and your union, you can go a long way in making the school better. She hopes to be remembered as someone who is easy to talk to, able to solve problems, and always reliable when it came to advice, fun, teaching music, and playing the trumpet.